What's up guys, uh, welcome back to the next video on learning Laravel. My name is QDS Dani and you guys are watching my channel Cryword. Alright, so in this video we're going to talk about unless. So before uh, we do unless uh, conditional statements, uh, you guys go ahead and uh, fire up your Laravel. Alright, so in the previous video we have uh, else and uh, if and else if. So we're going to remove this one and in this video we're going to talk about uh, unless. Unless uh, directly if you put it here, unless unless i want something just like a plain english unless uh, you do something for me or uh, unless this and that so what you're gonna, we're going to do is that you guys the skeleton is going to come in like this so it's going to be unless or it's going to be end unless and uh, inside this unless what you guys going to put a, for example if you're going to put a user uh, what the user for example uh, has a ticket for example our uh, user has uh, paid for example our user has uh, gone for example our user has uh, id for example has id our user is uh, logged in is is logged in for example you can uh, have a lot of uh, statements for example if it's logged in we can uh, say that user is logged in Alright, so now uh, in our case, for example, we're gonna put it uh, some condition, and uh, that condition is gonna come here. For example, product, or uh, we can put a condition. Say our condition is gonna be, say uh, for example, we're gonna put ID uh, double arrow operator. For example, one. Easy, very easy example. So we have a user ID, and we put a one. So in we put a, a less here unless uh, user id our id double equal to one and uh, we can put it here uh, user id is one for example unless user id is one and we put a user id is not one for example so we're gonna come we're gonna save and you're looking here i because our id is one unless if it's one we don't put it we say it's not uh, id is uh, not one and uh, we're gonna see what happens if you put the id for example uh, put the id is uh, two for example so we're gonna put id two So if you put ID is two, user ID is not one because uh, we put unless and uh, if our user ID unless is gonna come in, if uh, we put unless user ID is one, then the user ID is not one. So if you observe here, we have uh, our ID is equal to one and we put unless directives here. That's uh, inside the Laravel. So we can use it for uh, ID or inside the real world programming. We can use it unless the user is logged in or unless the user is logged out or unless our products this and that. And that's how we're gonna put it end unless. So if you can, you can put it unless ID is equal to one or unless ID is equal to 100, then you can uh, put this one. Otherwise there's no message. So this is very good for uh, if else because if else takes a lot of uh, room with the unless you guys say unless if it's ID is equal to one then uh, you can uh, put this one. Say for example now, our ID is two, but it, our ID is not one. So if our ID is not matching this one, then we're gonna put this one. Because uh, if our ID is matching, then we don't worry. That's what unless is. Unless you pay me this, I'll do this. Unless you pay me this, I'll do that. So that's what the unless in uh, plain English, the unless coming gonna come in. But you guys gonna rarely use this one, very, very rarely. But uh, you guys, is, you guys better know. So just in case, if you guys uh, bump up to this one in uh, real world programming, when you guys making a real world application, and you guys bump up to this, then you guys are gonna be scratching your head. What is this unless means? So that's what. If, for example, if the unless ID is one, because that's we are not uh, our ID is two. We are not satisfying this condition here. Then uh, we're gonna use. Uh, uh, for example, our user ID is for example 100. Then we're gonna uh, make this uh, 
uh, we're going to echo this statement here this uh, this line so here now if you look in here uh, user id is not 100 or it's not one we can put one for example because uh, our user id is not one either the user id is one or not one for example because unless user id is one if it's the user id is one by all means then uh, then uh, we don't want to do anything say for example if the user id is one don't show us anything unless it's one because uh, now it's uh, one for example now you're not going to see anything because uh, it's unless but if the user id is for example five then we're going to see this one because uh, we are not satisfying that uh, condition so now we're going to put it and we're going to put it on the user id is not one because a, a normally one is admin so that's what you guys uh, can use unless uh, conditional statement inside uh, laravel all right guys uh, that's it for this video thanks for watching and uh, don't forget to subscribe cryo if you guys have any question or comment leave in the comment box otherwise i'll see you guys in the next video and bye